Okay, so this is now me getting ready for you guys. This is our new robes. I'm super excited. They might be ready today, but... So, I use my plantitas moisturizer all the time, every day, morning and night. I put my plantitas... I usually just go like this. Just put two spots in. And I moisturize. And the movies, don't forget your neck. It's so important because that's where we show our age. So the first thing that I do is I go in with this brush. I absolutely love, love this brush. I use my Makeup Forever palette. This is my favorite palette, guys, okay? This is how much I use my palette. So I use all the colors. Sometimes you guys ask me, like, what color do you use? Well, here it is. So I have a brand new one right here that Paulina ordered for me. I'm so excited. Really what I do is I conceal the top of my eyes. So then I get um, this color right here. And... I just put it as a primer. So that's what I always do with Huda. Absolutely love it. And when I open it, you guys will see, obviously my favorite colors. I always blend like this pink right here and then this one right here. And sometimes I go in with like a little bit of the gold. I believe this is from Morphe. And I use, I always dip it in here a little bit and a little bit more on this one. I blow it. And I basically just come in on my corners just like this. And again, I'm doing it very quick. This is not a glam look. This is just every day I'm getting ready for work type of look. So shimmer just a tiny bit right here just for fun. It's Friday. Why not? Okay. This palette. I use it for contouring and I also use it for my eyeshadow. These two colors I absolutely love. It's just a flat brush. So I like to use these two colors to come in right here to do the highlight on the bone, on the camera. So I do that. And then um, if I need to blend it out a little bit more, I use the same brush that I was using before. Then um, I go in with my wipes, but I need to take the powder off of them. So I usually go in, there's like a little bit of powder. You see that? That makes a difference if you don't take this off of your eyebrows. So then I go back in and I take off the residue from the bottom and look at that, see? I love uh, Leslie, the bra guru. Even though my eyebrows are done, I just use a very, very little bit to define the front corners. So there, my eyebrows are done. That was quick. And then what I use this palette for again, this is how much I use it. Find them a little bit, put a little bit more. And this just makes them sharper and gives you more definition. And then I do that. I go back in with the brush that I really like, the flat brush, because you never want to leave anything that's like concealed or creamy without setting. So then I go back in with the powder and I just set it. Just open the new one because yeah, the other one's like, it just make it easy for me. So I go in with the darker color first under my eyes. So I would go in with, I'm going to go in with this one. Okay. And I go under my eyes and I pat it in. Pat. So then I blend it down. I blend it down, blend it. See, I always get no red around my nose. So I bring it all the way down, like this whole area. And then right here, ladies, I connect it and I go up and I flare it out. So this whole part of my face, it has the same color to start with. I contour with this. So I go in with the same brush and I just lightly contour a little bit. So I was in the middle of recording and my jaw started to lock up because again, like I said, I haven't recorded in a while, stress and all that. I want to make sure this video is really cute for you guys. So I'm going to take a gummy or I'm going to take my tincture. I think I'm going to take my tincture because it's Friday and um, I just feel like it gives me like the type of day I'm having. I need a little bit more than just a gummy. I'll show you guys, this is a full tincture. Do you see that? That's full, right? So then I'll just drop it down. I'm like, I'll take about a half today. There we go. And all you do is under your tongue. Okay, so I hold it under my tongue for about 30 seconds and I'm going to go on. This is Jane Ardell. I love this foundation. I've been using it for a really long time. A little bit goes a long way. Okay, so I have this brush and then look at how little bit I put on there. Okay, so it's not much, right? I go in, in, and I use circular motions. And it's a BB cream. But it's so good. I mean, I love, love this foundation. It just makes everything so flawless. You get ready so quickly with it. See, it's kind of happening. Do you guys see this happening to me? This is my TMJ when I start to get stressed stressed out. This is what happens. So in about 20 minutes, it's going to, it comes and goes. See that? That's, it's on camera. 
because this is why I developed CBD and I'm not having a seizure. It's literally my stress. So this, um, I like to set under my eyes. This is a banana powder. I usually use uh, Laura Mercier, Laura Mercier, but right now I'm using this one. I bought it in LA and it's, it's a cheapy one, but you know what guys, it, it works. So I'm all over the place with my makeup. So I like to put this under my eyes to set my makeup and I go in with Mac. I use color, this is A60 and I just go in and I blot my whole face, brush it on. Like I said again, guys, I am doing a daily quick makeup, not a fancy one or anything like that. This is my daily routine. I usually can do this if I'm not recording and probably what, Paulina, like, like, 15, like 15, 20 minutes come in with Anastasia again. And I just lightly come in and then I like to do my nose. One of these, just something light. Just a little lightness right there. And then I'll probably have to just blend it out. So this is what I use as my blush. I've been using this one oh, quite some time. I just like it. And depending on what I'm wearing, I'll mix like, you know, lighter or darker. So today I'm gonna go with the middle one. And then I like to highlight, I've been using this one. My daughter Delilah gave it to me, it's Fenty. I really like it, it's so pretty. And, and I just go in right here, just put a little bit. Put that there. And then I do my nose right here. I like to use um, Glam by Dora's glue. So I'll show you guys right now. I'm waiting because she went to go get me my bag. Yes. <gasps> Why did you buy so many? I, I thought it was one of each. Oh my God, David Marino. <laughs> David! This is the pack that I told you to get, right? Mm -hmm. And look at what you brought me. Yeah, they don't have that there. You're such a liar. I asked them. I asked them where the where is this at? <laughs> They're like, oh, it's over there, and that's what they had. They didn't have these. So I sent them these ones right here, and there was only supposed to be five, not eighteen per pack. But okay. what are you pissed off at? Well, it was just because you didn't they, follow orders. Vanessa, you're gonna use it either way. So they did have them. You don't want me to call. No, them. no, no. You got more than you expected. Right. So you're gonna use them either way, right? Yeah. Then what are you mad for? <laughs> What's the issue? Well, the what, issue. Next time, you know what? Next time, just go there next time. Just I don't have time. No. Oh, that's cool. That's why I FaceTime you, right? <laughs> yeah, I guess. But it was blurry. Oh, it was blurry? And I sent you pictures of everything that was right there? I went. Picture, I was driving. Picture, picture, I was picture, driving. Picture. <laughs> I was driving when you sent was... it to me. <laughs> I used my glue. And I just put it on here, just like this. And you let it sit for like a couple seconds so it gets like a little tacky, so it sticks better on your eyeball. I just pop it right in. Usually I will curl my lashes, but I'm not even gonna look for my lash color right now. Cause... So you have to make sure that the glue dries. It's like, not dries, but it's not super wet because then it moves around. Okay, so this is me with lashes. Um, makes, that's what makes all the difference in the world to me, honestly. Now all I just have to do is put on my mascara. And I like L'Oreal's mascara. So I, I usually blend in the lashes with my real lashes with the extensions or the false lashes. Yes. It's so weird. You guys always ask me what lipstick I use. It's this one. I use it almost every day. I, it's called Allure. And this lipstick stays on all day, guys. I don't know what it is about this lipstick, but I love it. And it kind of goes with everything. This is pretty much my finished look. Um, I'm going to put on my, I put my roller on. I usually put this on for my stress. I do this every day. And then when I'm done with my makeup, I set it with VSCBD's Rose Water. Mm. it smells so good and it helps my makeup stay on all day this is what i use so okay now. so i'm taking my hair down and i love these brushes we also sell them on our website um they sell them everywhere but they're wet brushes and they really don't like pull your hair too much so hair's a little oily i use a uh, blue luna and it's their dry shampoo and i just basically put it on here just to give it some volume and also to get rid of the uh, um, 
shiny the shiny looks when if my hair was wet i use this the leave-in conditioner by healthy sexy hair all this stuff is available on our website just so you i use the kendra blow dry spray oh my god my favorite i want to recreate this for vs and this after play i use um two sides curling irons i use inch and a half and inch and a quarter as you guys can see my hair is uh straight right now so i'm gonna curl it so what i usually do is i section it off okay bioionic uh curling iron put it myself at temperature at 430 okay this honestly is the best curling iron ever this is what i do I, kind of like a candy cane i troll it and but look at how fast it curls okay guys and then i pull it down because i don't want quinceanera curls and this is like this is like a little piece but i'll just look at how fast so watch it be like that video that girl and it falls out so there you go i don't want it to be super um super curly and i just start at the root and i bring it down and it just to reinforce it and i troll it in okay you can see see how i like to keep it like coming down that way again i don't like it to be super curly that's not the look i'm going for today <laughs> um and that's it i just grab like little sections well kind of big sections actually because the bigger the section is the bigger the wave will be and i'm going more for like a wave look not a senora quinceanera and i like to pull it down just like that see and then right here ladies be very very careful because one it's your forehead two these little baby hairs are already we put so much heat on them that they tend to break especially now that we want this like money piece in the front that one I'm going to have to do like in the mirror, but that this is so, so see, that's been like two minutes and I already had my hair pretty much done. It makes all the difference in the world if you have the right tools. And I like to, like I said, pull it. Don't leave a lot of heat on there because it's not cute. So then it's all curled, right? Then I go in with, I love this hairspray. It's, can you see it, Paulina? Mm -hmm. Okay. This is basically sex. No, this is a bed head. And I go in. I spray it, I let it sit a little bit, and then I just run it through my fingers like this. And then I always use this usually after. See, I put a little bit, it gives you some texture. And that's what I do. I just separate it and it, especially like right here to calm down the little flyaways, it really works. And that's pretty much it. That's what I do. It's getting ready with me. That's it okay guys so that's the makeup that's the hair look it's just a beachy wave that i did and um yeah i hope you guys enjoy it there you go there's paulina helping <laughs> me in the background record this but yeah this is a quick getting ready with vanessa sanchez moreno